so he likes to switch stance, you like to switch stance. Do you think your stance switching might give you an edge in this fight? Uh, I don't know. It's, you know, it's good to be bystantial, you know, as they say it. Uh, I'm excited. I'm ready to, you know, match his footwork, be one step ahead of the game. And, you know, I know he switches stances, stances too. Uh, it's going to be an exciting fight, that's for sure. Is the plan to make him go backwards? Because sometimes he's a little bit less effective when he's going backwards than when he's moving forward. Well, that's the thing, you know, I can put the pressure on, I can fight going backwards, I can, you know, capitalize on, you know, counters, um, you know, who knows, it's definitely going to be an exciting fight, I know that for sure, he's a great striker, he's a great opponent for me, I just can't wait. Do you think people underestimate uh, your well-roundedness as a fighter when you were fighting Mitch, you had some takedowns, you heard him from the top, but they didn't take it seriously till you finished the fight. Do you think that's something that people overlook when they look at your fight? They think you're just a really good striker. Oh, for sure, for sure. Like, you know, every time I've heard somebody talk about my fighting style, it's like, oh, he's very athletic. Oh, he's very explosive. So it's like, you know, I just want to prove myself, you know, in the next couple of fights that I have a full, well-rounded game and not just be called explosive and athletic anymore. I want to be well-balanced and dominant all the way through from the moment we, you know, Touch gloves, standing, to resting, to jits. I want to be ready and have all the answers all the way through whatever the, fights, the fight takes us. He was saying earlier, yeah, I've lost some fights, but they've been against very good guys that are very wrestling heavy, like Craig McLean, Ali Vasuk. He goes, all my losses are against guys who have just basically laid on top of me like a carpet. Yeah. I'm glad Gio doesn't do that. <laughs> so do you think, will, is the plan to stand up with him? Because that's, he's saying nobody will stand up with me besides him. He'll probably stand up yeah. with him, so it's going to be fine. Yeah, yeah, that's for sure. It really depends, right? Like if, you know, if I'm getting the best of him, if he's besting me standing up, maybe I might shoot. But we'll see. It's MMA. we got to mix this shit up, right? So, and you know, shout out Craig. I've gotten rounds with Craig. He's a very good wrestler. And we got some good work in, so I'm just happy to be able to, you know, test my skill against a tough opponent or a tough training partner like him. I know, you know, he's, he's the top of this division right now. And yeah, I'm just super stoked to, you know, have access to training with him. And it plays a big part, right? Like, you know, he's fought Tyler already. And it just, you know, fight community is pretty small around here. And I'm just excited to perform, showcase, showcase my skill and pick, you know, all the older guys' brains. And I just want to be a sponge the next couple of years.